Toronto, it's getting pretty warm. <laughs> so, a couple days ago, we've been doing some shows all around Ontario, and uh, about two days ago, um, I played, the, we played this song, it's the title track of the record, it's called Siberia. We played it, we played it for the first time two nights ago, and I was really excited, and I was like, this is cool, like, I get to play a new song. And then uh, that night, Siberia was trending on Twitter. I like the internet. And I was like, oh, hell yeah, my song is trending. But it had nothing to do with my song. This um, rocket carrying supplies to the Russian space station crashed in Siberia. And the explosion was so big, it was heard for like 100 kilometers around. So, I mean, there was no tie-in. Let's hope not, anyway, let's hope my song had nothing to do with that. It was unmanned, no one got hurt. But it was kind of crazy. It's just so weird how timing like that works out. Anyway, I'm gonna play you Siberia right now. This is only the third time we've ever played it. And it's fun. It's kind of like, I've never actually been to Siberia, but somebody said to me once, man, we could be happy anywhere. We could go to Siberia and still have fun, you know? And Siberia is kind of an unknown, and it's kind of known to being cold and a little bit unfriendly, but it's adventure and it's exciting, and that's what life is all about. So the record's called Siberia for that reason, and this is where that song came out of. That thing somebody said that once. Yeah. 